Cherunya area. To a story here that we, all, we are also focusing on tonight with Dr. Otende Amolo. President William Ruto's pet housing project has moved, to, or has moved a step closer to realization after his troops bulldozed the Affordable Housing Bill 2023 through the third reading in the National Assembly. All the amendments proposed by the Joint Committee sailed through easily on Wednesday during the session while the opposition members of parliament were frustrated and stormed out of the House after the amendments were defeated on the floor. People as this, Mr. Speaker. And therefore, Mr. Speaker, I wish to congratulate every member who has sat through this bill, who has helped this country to move forward, and to say that, Mr. Speaker, the generations coming will thank the House that sat to pass this bill for solving a problem, a generational problem, Mr. Speaker. So, Mr. Speaker, even as we create jobs, we are looking forward to rolling out this affordable housing, even in my constituency in Kipkelion, where land is already available for putting up houses. And I want to ask the executive to concentrate, Mr. Speaker, first of all, to give housing to those people who support housing. I have, oh, uh, question. I have confirmed that the house is properly constituted for the purpose of making a decision. Now, therefore, put the question, which is that the affordable housing no bill, course. National Assembly Bill number no 75 for 2023, be now read at that time. Will as many of that opinion say aye? Aye. Will as many of that opinion say nay? Nay. Ayes have it. Very interesting indeed in Parliament. One of the topics of discussion.